Much amazing. Yeah. There is no one like me. Hey guys, this is your favorite Canadian gamer girl here, the floor hugger, and you're looking at my pride and joy. Not a baby. Well, it is my baby, but this is my PlayStation 3 controller. It is beautiful. It is black. It is the standard one. It is the first one I got with my, sorry, first one I got with my PlayStation 3. It's, it's whatever, but it's my pride and joy, and it's the only one I got. Today I'm bringing you something. Put that up in the background. Special. Now, if you've seen my other video, you've seen that I have this for Xbox as well. This is the Avenger controller. Uh, thank you to Avenger controllers for sending this to me, letting me do this demo on it, and giving me a promo code to give to you guys so you can pick one up for 10% off. Now, I'm just going to show you guys a bit of the box. I know I'm scrolling by fast, but I want to get this open, I want to get it on, and I want to start playing with it eventually. So, let's get the unboxing knife, grizzly knife cut right in the center even though they probably say don't cut in the center hugger don't read speed this up alright <laughs> then we slide the pretty box off oh that's gorgeous 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 alright guys pop this bad boy open and what do we get in the box let's start with that we get the instructions how to put it on uh, you get parts in here and I think rubber foam things for later instructions this is the Avenger Elite controller let me uh, say this so Avenger also has a YouTube, so if you guys want to go check that out. Oh, feel the goodness. Some nice foam in the bottom. Sorry. Let me take that out. It's going to be a little loud. Sorry for the... Camera angle and the noise. 30 and I have to close my window because my neighbors are making too much noise. That is the Avenger Elite controller for the PlayStation 3. I have one for the Xbox. I will put a link in the video. Or, uh, I will probably put a link in the video and also put a link in the description to check out that previous video. Now, take a take a look at it. This is the Elite. I repeat again got cool little dips and notches here. Alright, you're probably like, Hugger, get this thing open, get your controller in, and let's get this party started. Alright, so want to lay it in like that? Maybe, maybe not. Let's put the faceplate on first. Oh, that's beautiful. It doesn't... Okay, never mind, I'll just shut up and... Wow, that snapped in very nice. Alright, let's go over this, you guys. Doesn't block any of the buttons. Still everything move. You can still use all your buttons. Still see the top. You still need, if you need to charge it. These doesn't block your buttons. Nice. Okay, let's go over the controller itself. These are your arms. The whole point of the controller is to improve you, your skill as a player and to improve your reaction time. So never take your fingers off the analogs unless you gotta go pee or you're not playing anymore. These are your trigger trigger switches. The rubber bands, you can use the extended triggers. How much they stick out for you PlayStation guys, you know what I mean. Some people don't like these 
I haven't played with it yet, so I have to get used to it. And these these rubber bands, trigger bands, can be adjusted. So let's see if we can get a shot of that. So you can have instead of moving all of that, you can move that a bit like a scuff controller. You can adjust it to what you need. So if everything is adjusted. You bend your arms right. You fit this to custom made for you. You fit this for you. The whole point is, you never. You flick your fingers here, here, and here. You roll your hand. You never have to take your fingers off your analog sticks to shoot. Now I hold my controller a bit weird, so this will be something to get used to. I hold it three fingers in the back, two on the front, kind of like this, and then like that. But with this here, it's gonna might take a bit to get used to. And if you're wondering what the hell this is, Xbox One has it too. You can take it off, but I will leave it on for now and see what happens. It's for to put it in your lap, and we open it. To put it in your lap, it's basically a lap rest. You play, you put it in your lap. It doesn't... it's not essential. I mean, most people don't play with their controllers in their laps. Um, gotta say it, I need to adjust these to make better for me maybe bend the arms for me um, it's it's not too much weight to the controller itself which is nice you don't want something that's big and bulky and sitting on your controller and messing with your playing style so I gotta say a plus to that it's a pretty slick looking design I will take this sticker off because I know hours of playing it will eventually get sweated off anyway but this is an E3 ID bright idea winner and uh, I have to play with it play around with it play with it more to really give a opinion about it so I want to thank Avenger controllers for saying yes and giving me this opportunity um, they gave me one for Xbox and for PlayStation 3, so I will be playing... PlayStation 3 is a little dark in the corner. I'll be playing with both of them. Um, see what's going on. See uh, how good it... If it's good as really as they say, give my honest opinion. That's what they asked for. And so I will, I will be giving... Uh, I'll leave my code in the bottom, so if you guys want to pick this up, or if you guys want to wait and see what I think and then pick it up, whatever you guys want. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you Avenger Controllers. This is the Flora Hugger, your favorite Canadian gamer girl. And always stay thirsty, my friends.